Hey everybody, GeoArm Security here, and today I'm going to show you how to add a duress panic code into your Honeywell Lynx Touch L5210 all-in-one home and business security system. Now the duress code we definitely recommend, it's a great feature to have on your security panel, and what it is is Typically on a normal day, your alarm system is going off, you enter your home, you enter your disarm code and everything's fine. What the duress code is, is kind of trickery. So let's say uh, an intruder had a gun to your back or some kind of weapon and threatened you to disarm the system or, or else. What this code is, is instead of entering your typical code to disarm the system, you enter this four digit code, which will silence the alarm, notify our central station that there is a panic alarm going on meaning there is trouble at your home and the police department will be dispatched immediately with the system already being disarmed so the intruder will think that the system has been disarmed and everything's fine but the truth is the police department will be on its way already so this is a great feature in order to unlock it you want to go ahead and select security more tools you want to go ahead and enter your master code which is one, two, three, four by default. You want to select user. You want to select duress. Make sure it's highlighted. Select edit. And you'll notice the box is blank. So by default, it does not come with a duress code. So go ahead and select user code. The screen will prompt you to enter your duress, duress code. In some cases, you know, some people use 1379, just the outer boxes, but we personally recommend just make sure you use a number that you're going to remember. That's the most important thing. So we'll go ahead and just do 1379, select done, select save most importantly. Now you can back out. After you have activated this, we do recommend setting up an appointment with GeoArm to make sure that your alarm system first is activated, second of all that the duress code was entered correctly, and we'll test the signals to make sure that the duress code does go through so that in the event that you actually need to use it, it will work. And that's how you add a duress code into your Honeywell Lynx Touch L5210 all-in-one home and business security system. Please make sure to subscribe to our YouTube page view our blog at DIYsecurityblog.com or you can reach us at 1-877-443-6276.